I'm sitting here with Rachel Fields, previous leader of freshman activities at CSF and current attendee of CSF and 608 in her spare time. Um, we're going to talk a little bit today about what's going on on campus regarding religion and around town since Lexington is a big college town. So first off, what's your religion? Christian. Okay. Um, you've been involved at CSF in the past. Um, can you tell me a little bit about your experience there? Um, CSF is a college outreach ministry, I would say, focused on pulling in students that are on campus who maybe don't aren't involved in a religious organization or never have been. Um, it focuses a lot on move-in day, freshman move-in day, um, big activities like that where they can go and be a part of social activities and pull in people. Okay. Overall, do you feel that CSF offers students a place to express their religion and who they are? I'm going to say no because, well, that's not fair. I guess sometimes it does. I don't think it offers a lot of diversity of expression of religion. I don't think if you don't come in as a Christian that you're really given the opportunity to express why you feel that way. Um, I do think that it offers some discussion opportunities to understand some ideas a little bit deeper maybe of the faith, but not not really a diverse group. No, I don't think so. Okay, and as for Lexington, we already mentioned that it's a pretty big college town. In terms of religion and religious diversity on campus and around town, do you think that it is a good job of offering students a wide variety of churches to pick from? Lexington? Um, no, I think most people attend 608 at Southland. In Lexington, I don't think there's a huge group. I know that my home church has a very small college ministry that meets on Sunday mornings with four or five people, and that's about all that we do. They don't do much during the week or offer a lot of other activities other than that. Um, but 608 is it's a good program for people to go to, but it's probably the only one. Okay, thank you.